Lance Armstrong's case is simple. He used performance enhancing drugs to get an advantage of winning the Tour de France seven times. Transfusions and testosterone. Instead of looking at sports, I'm going to examine cheating academically. Here at NIU, the classes that are mostly affected by cheating are general education courses. Students don't want to take these classes, so a small percentage try to cheat to get by. The final grade for a student who cheats in a class will be decided by the teacher. And you certainly can't just take a big chunk of it and cut and paste it into your paper. So in that case, it was a high enough level class that I felt it was, uh, you know, they just had, they failed the class. Most students who find themselves in this office are in trouble. So if they are there because they cheated, the penalty for NIU students cheating academically can vary between getting expelled, suspended, or probation. In most cases, the students end up failing the class. There are about 40 cases of academic cheating every semester, but this is very small for a university that has over 20,000 students. So is it possible you could be accused of academic misconduct and stay? Yes. Cheating doesn't happen much at NIU, but does the punishment fit the crime? Troy Webster, this is NTC News.